Hello, buzz and girls. My name is Hans D, and welcome back to more oxygen not included. Where last time we tried to uh, uh, build a Draco farm so we can get a bit of uh, more fiber so we have enough for our suits. But unfortunately, they only grow, grow their scales uh, in hydrogen something we do not have a lot of and is difficult to transport so what we will do here instead we will let them lay eggs and uh, then take their meat and we have three additional eggs down here and do we have any more Let's roaming about. No. And looking over here, uh, we never had much copper, uh, and our gold reserves are also down a bit. Um, we got our gold from this volcano. This volcano uh, still 33 cycles from becoming active again. Then what I also noticed um, with all the oxygen that we are pulling out for our various uh, atmosphere ducts up here and down here, um, water level here is going down. So I think what we should do is hook this one up and this might also then uh, enable these to grow again so let's figure out power um, I think what we can have here is something simple and then we need the thick power cable to here and probably we will run out of gold on the way and then we have isolated pipe um, actually we can pull that out on this side uh, let's go over here down Bridge here, bridge there, in here, we can connect like this. Oh, mm, actually not, because that's the uh, the input. We do not want to hook that up directly. Take this. Down here. And hook it up to that. Which means we will need another bridge there. Right. That basically means we have to see how far we get with our gold supply and if we run out of gold what we do instead. And as you can see um, already have a bit of uh, of this marked that we do not have materials for it. So let's see what we can do instead. Um, I 
this one. Could do it out of aluminium. Uh, I yeah, let's let's do it out of aluminium because that's something that we have quite a bit of, and we are not using it for anything else than for our exosuits. But seeing that our exosuits are waiting for reed fiber, um, that will probably take a while until it is done. Um, right. And with our water sieve down here, we could even think about switching out the laboratory. Um, but the toilets, they produce more water than they consume. And I think I do not want to have the clean water uh, go in there because that could still contain uh, uh, germs uh, so instead we might um, pull that up here and uh, dump it in there and if we should ever come by sufficient amounts of, uh, of polluted water we might be able to uh, use it for a farm. Or should we have something closer by? That might actually be preferable. We want to take that way. And the output take that way. a bit messy down here but and basically here on this side um, let's, oh, let's not break everything let's only deconstruct the tile because in the tiles there is pipage we don't want to break that. Uh, how are we looking? Yep. You are almost done with reproduction. And where is your uh, your friend? Don't see it here. 
What do we have in here? Nothing useful. So let's forgo that. And we will have a door like this. We will have a bit of a level down here. Um, and I think the tank like this. And we dig that out. And put the wind there. So out here we will have isolated pipe. Here, still need a bit of power wire going and a pipe hitch, and we should get there eventually. So let's give uh, the, the duplicates uh, a bit of a chance to catch up before we supply them with more work. By the looks of it, we just made it in time uh, here, because from this side, we do not see, oh, we do not see any water coming because we kept it off here and we do not have any bridges. But, yes. So now we can look at how to complete this uh, setup over here. So here we need a bridge like that. Um, and there we need another bridge. So here. line. This is the dirty water line. Let's do it like this. And then we can go in and uh, replace the toilets and sinks one at a time. Due to the fact that we are siphoning off a bit of water here, we had not enough water in a system to scrub the thing, so we have here now a, a bridge that supplies additional water to the system. Accidentally, I built part of the pipe pitch an isolated pipe. Don't need that here inside our base, but we can start here by uh, Constructing this one and I guess this toilet. And then have something better in place there. A laboratory. So then let's figure out where we are at. This is the output, which means this is the intake. And 
let's just build that pipe for everything. That direction. Then construct this one. And it's exactly the wrong way around. we need to pump in the clean water in here and dirty water we are taking that out there which means that the pipes here with this setup are a bit longer But um, we can have um, we do not have to uh, uh, switch over uh, pipes more than we have down here already. So let's see, anything good? Ooh, iron, yes. Thank you. And a bit of uh, water here in the backfill. And we can actually break off this bridge because uh, the rest of the water will fill itself in. And so far we do not yet have any excess water because our pipes are not yet backlogged. But we should have that pretty soon. level here is rising again which means we have enough water coming out of here for our production and this is important because eventually this one will go dormant in 17 cycles for um, about 30 cycles so the amount of water that we have stored must be sufficient for 30 cycles, otherwise we have a problem. Uh, this geyser up here is active for 24 more cycles and then it has a dormancy of around 100 cycles. So, I would guess we will have energy problems uh, once we run out of gas. Uh, this one, 23 cycles before we get more gold. So, I hope that before we run out of gas here, we manage to get down here somewhere to find another energy source that we can use. And we have finished all the toilets. 
we have a bit of, of water backlogged here. So let's deconstruct this pipe here uh, as our last action of this episode. I hope you enjoyed this one and join me next time when I don't know what we will do, but something will come around. Until then, goodbye!